James Higgins enters the 2025 NHL draft season widely projected as the number one prospect. The 18-year-old center is regarded as an elite playmaker thanks to his high-end hockey sense, speed, and puck skills. I try to be a guy out there that set up guys, try to look for that pass, and just try to create offense. Hockey IQ comes into play with that. It definitely helps out out there, especially when the game speeds up. It's uh, you know a lot more thinking has to go on. It's faster, so you have to make plays a lot quicker. You know you want guys in the team that are able to kind of fit into any spot, any role that the coach needs, and you know it's something that I, I try to help bring to the table. I uh, just want to be able to try to make others around me better and just help out to the team in any way possible. The biggest thing I've noticed for him is like he's just so naturally good and he's just added on to it like all the little things he does right. And it's cool to see him and watch and learn. I can learn a bunch from him and others on the team too. The way he can make plays right you know when we're doing three on two, two on one drills the the passes he's making you know the sauces the quick turns um, you know finding guys late stuff to follow as a goalie. I think he's kind of similar to Gabe in the sense of his playmaking and just hockey IQ which I think is just really important for a centerman like he is. And obviously his speed is well, and he's able to move around and get pucks in places that can score and stuff like that. He's a fun guy to be around. He's always smiling, always having fun. So he's going to be doing some special things. Definitely looking forward to playing with him. Hagens grew up on Long Island, playing hockey with his older brother, Michael, and often coached by their father, Mike. James idolized the New York Islanders, but credits his father for helping instill his deep love for the game at an early age. I've always been around the game. My dad played, so he was uh, he was a big Isles fan. So he would kind of grow up watching the Isles, kind of you know falling in love with it, and then he'd build an outdoor rink every uh, every Christmas. And me and my brother would stay out late at night, and we'd play one on one, you know, working on our shot, little stuff like that. Just uh, you know, having fun out there. It's kind of where the game starts for you and you know it's kind of where your love for the game it all begins so I guess uh, that was a big that was a big factor in you know how we started. And I feel very lucky I was able to do that. Um, we played Long Island Royals growing up. Superior ice rinks close to home and very family oriented type place. To be able to spend 10 years you know with them and through all those tournaments and practices it's uh, you don't get those years back it was, it was special. Higgins will spend his draft season at Boston College looking to help the Eagles win a national championship after they fell just short last season. He will likely play a lot with two first round NHL draft picks in Ryan Leonard and Gabe Perot, filling the hole left by Will Smith, who departed for the NHL after last season. A national championship would be nice. That's obviously the goal to strive for and you kind of understand that, you know, you're going there and you're going to do whatever you need to, uh, you know, try and take that back home. I feel like that's that's going to be something that's really special. It's going to be something that, you know, motivates everyone and hopefully we, uh, hopefully we win it. While the NHL draft hype around Hagens continues to grow, he remains focused on his team and his own development. The main focus is getting to school and growing with the guys in the group and, you know, working to win the national championship and, you know, obviously the rest of that stuff will, uh, you know, it kind of unfolds as long as, you know, you stick to the plan and, you know, you, you make sure you just kind of take it day by day.